Hello, อาจารย์ดอน Ready and gentlemen. My name is p i t a w a s u t h a r i of four and five. Today, I proud to present my favorite movies. My favorite movie is I Love You, Philip Morris. I Love You, Philip Morris is a 2009 romantic comedy drama film based on real life. The film is. The directorial debut of Green Fikara and John l e e k w a l It's got a little over uh, 20 million worldwide after its limited theatrical release. It was released to theater on the 3rd December 2010. And then I want to present two main, main character, characters. The first character is Jim Carrey, plays l a z e l He is a good c h u r c h g o i n g police officer who was across t h e s i s homosexual but decided to come out f a m i n g after a near father's car crash. But as l a z e l l a z e l explained in his narration, being gay is expensive. So l a z e l l took to being a con man, which worked out like all con men who don't run financial firms. The second character is Philip Morris, as played by Evan McGregor. Uh, in the, in this movie, he is a gentle soul who is also enjoyed. For Freud, the part of this story, this uh, this story starts with Stephen J. l a z e l l is on his deathbed, recalling the event of his wa- his life. He spent his e a r y a d o w n year in Virginia with Virginia Beach as a pro- police officer. He played organ at church, has. An e n t h u s i a s t i c sex with his wife, Debbie, Debbie, le- uh, and spend his off hour searching for his biological mother, who gave him up as a child. Stephen locates his biological mother, but she rejects him without explanation. After a car crash, Stephen leaves his. And previous here yeah, life behind, uh, the, uh, and explore the world as his true self. He moved to Miami, finds a boyfriend, and live a luxurious lifestyle to keep himself and his boyfriend in the style to which they have become accustomed. Stephen become a con man. Stephen is caught. And sent to prison, where he falls in love with inmate Philip Morris. Stephen cannot bear to be separate from Philip. After being released, he helps get Philip freed from prison by posing as a lawyer, then attains well by fraudulently acquiring. A position as chief financial officer of a large company, Stephen eventually gets caught, embracing from the company, and goes back to prison. Philip is also sent to jail as an accomplice, and angrily tells Stephen he never want to see him again. Months later. Philip learns from another inmate that Stephen is dying of AIDS. Heartbroken, Philip calls Stephen why he is in the infirmary and confesses that's why he is still obsessed with Stephen for lying to him. He still loves him. Philip is rather told that Stephen has died. Sometime later. Philip is taken to meet with his lawyer and finds Stephen waiting for him. Stephen describes 
how he faked having AIDS, ARDS, and dying in order to see Philip again, and promises to never lie to him again. He ran off our. Uh, he runs on. He ran once last con to break Philip out of jail. Only to be caught when he runs into an own coworker. At the end of movie, explain that real life Philip Morris was released from jail in two thousand six, but Stephen is still in prison on twenty three hour lockup. Only having one for three hour a day to shower and exercise. The last scene shows Stephen lodging. Joyce fully while running across the prison yard, got in pursuit in another attempt to be with Philip. Okay. In my opinion, I think I have a. Uh, Some something to tell everyone about this movie. Is this a week of this film? It is not too for everyone because it isn't very good and was graphic, nudity. Is what are or take take enough? So I can I can uh, only you I can only assume you mean graphic sexuality. In movie and discomfort with homosexuality is not a good enough excuse for me to uh, not watch a movie. Gay people everywhere have been watching straight people uh, get it on in the movies forever, and they are still able to look past that and see the film for what it is. Hmm. I have, uh, the six question to ask everyone. The first question: What is Stephen and his family religions, and how do pronounce of this word, religion? The answer is. They are, Christian. And pronounce, uh, of this word. Religion. The second answer is, what thing that leads him to find mother? The answer. The answer is, he want to know about his real family. The third question. What theme, mood and climax in this movie? The answer is escape from present, present life, self-destructive, romance, cons, and scam. And uh, the fourth question is, was Stephen know he was homosexual? The answer is after he catches his car and separates with. His wife, and then uh, after you watch all scenes of this movie, what is the aim and purpose of movie? The answer is everyone must have best side and revise by their way. And the last question in this movie, Debbie said, "This man who pursues me to the end so end of." The earth and promise me a life of eternal happiness. Can you pronounce the end of like a linking word from textbook correctly? Okay, I have the answer for you. Uh, you can pronounce correctly. The ends, the ends of. Can you hear? Can you hear? Hear me say it. The ends of K. Ah, uh, I learned many pronunciation skill for movie. One thing, uh, is phonetics. I have changed to listening English from nature 
a native speaker that's enlightened me to develop my English skill in correctly way and gonna be mastery teacher. Goodbye.